Another death-defying stunt on the high wire for a member of the famous Walinda family. Rick Walinda just wrapped up a high wire walk in St. Petersburg's Sundial. Today's walk comes while several of his family members, including his sister, recover from a fall during practice this week. News Channel A's Chip Osowski joining us live from where it all just took place. A lot of eyes on the sky there today, I'm sure, Chip. You're absolutely right, Rod. And as with all Walenda walks, there was no safety harm harness, no safety net. Rick Walenda relying on skills and years of practice to complete this walk. He conquered his latest stunt at 5 o'clock right over the sundial. This just days after family members were involved in a tragic accident at Circus Sarasota. At last check, two of those performers were still in the hospital recovering. The highlight of today's act, a handstand in the middle of the wire. But Walenda told me he had to do it very quickly because he felt something wasn't right with the wire. I did a very fast headstand because something was slipping on the wire. I felt something slipping and I don't know what it was. And I didn't know until I got near the end. Uh, my nephew checked both ends for me. He said they were fine. That last rope there was slipping just a little bit on the wire. And when you feel something slip a little bit, it's magnified when you're standing on it that high up in the air. And I got to tell you, there was a little bit of a slip and ever, there was a collective gasp out there. Walenda told me what happened in Sarasota does not affect his mindset when he's on the high wire. The Daredevil family's next stop, the Florida Strawberry Festival in Plant City. Reporting live in St. Petersburg, I'm Chip Osowski, News Channel 8. All right, Chip, thanks so much. We appreciate it. A break